So people here are described as nice, Minnesota nice, and it's true. I just know, for example, I went with a friend to a concert. It was a Tuesday night. We went to Minneapolis downtown. We went to a pink concert with my car, and we parked in downtown. And it was minus 25 below Celsius. So it was really cold, and we had snow. And yeah, everything went well. We went to the concert, and at midnight, we were at the car again. And we were in the car, and I was typing, and I was like, something is wrong. I went out of the car, and we had a flat tire. And we never, I never had a flat tire before, my friend too. We had no idea what to do. First thing, we, we laughed for two minutes because the situation was just amazing. And then there was just a man and a woman, and my friend was just going towards them, and they were already asking, what's the problem? And it was cold, and it was midnight, and they did not even ask us. They just, the man just changed our tire. It was just self-evident for him. He was like, okay, open your trunk. I can do it for you. And 10 minutes and we could drive home and everyone was safe and even two other cars stopped. Even though they saw that someone is helping us, they asked, can we help us? Do you need help? Are you sure everything is right? Yeah, yeah, thank you so much. So they are really nice, the people here. You are always welcome and yeah, that's great. And um, in winter it's really cold, uh, but it's also an adventure. I never had so much snow before, so there are some cool things to do in winter like snowshoeing, skiing, snowshoeing, ice skating. It's a lot of fun. And the summer here is really hot, really hot. And the landscape is pretty because of all the lakes here. And I went on vacation with my host family to a cabin and it was I I would never tell I would never say I'm a person who really likes camping a lot. We did not camp but we did things like fishing and kayaking and it was one of the most beautiful places I've ever been to, I think. And I went to a few places on Earth. So it was it really it's really pretty. Also in um it's great to have the seasons. So you have a great summer, then you have a great um fall. It's beautiful because of all the colours and you go out and you go to the pumpkin patch, and you pick your apples, and you have Halloween, and the kids enjoy it so much. And then it comes winter. Okay, winter's maybe a little bit too long, but it's extreme. And I think we do not have spring so much, because it gets from really cold to really hot. But I will see. I didn't experience it yet, so I will see. <laughs> so I think everything, every au pair that comes to Minnesota lives near the Twin Cities. Because um, this is mainly where not everyone in Minnesota lives, but I would say families that would have an au pair live around the Twin Cities because they work in the Twin Cities in Minneapolis or St. Paul. So we have a lot of suburbs. Most of my friends are just spread out around the Twin Cities and the suburbs. And um, you do a lot of things then in the Twin Cities. So you go downtown, you go out, you can go to clubs for dancing, we go out for for shopping a lot. We have the Mall of America, yay, <laughs> the biggest mall in America, and you don't have to, um, how do you say, on your clothes, you, you, there are no fees anymore? Taxes? You don't have to pay taxes, that's the best thing. <laughs> and so we have this, and we have a lot of places. So. We have, um, if you want to go to the countryside, you just have to drive. I just just have to drive 20 minutes and I can do horseback riding or I can go canoeing or I can go out for hiking. And if I want to do something action, there are a lot of concerts, there are cinema, there, I don't know, there are so many places to go. So we are never bored, never. The good thing was also I came here with no, um, how do you say, expectations? I had no expectations. Well, of course, some on my own, like for myself, but not for the state. I didn't know, I, I wrote a lot out of, about it, but I think if I would have gone to the East Coast, 
I already had in my mind, okay, I want to see this city, this city, this city. And if I didn't, if I would have not done this, <laughs> I would be sad, I think, because I would have had it in my head already. And I came here with no expectations and everything I experienced was just great. So it made me feel more happy. And yeah, I really, I really like it.